Oh, it's a magnificent way to start a summer of cricket, particularly a competition between these two fierce competitors, Australia and New Zealand. Tahuhu with that first delivery, bang on. Oh, Mooney lofts straight away, she's gone! She holds out, the catch has been taken by Green. We'll get back to Amy Satterthwaite. What a huge scalp for the New Zealanders. Oh, that's beautifully played. Punches it through the extra cover region. It's a quick outfield. It was just a push though, wasn't it, from Lanning? Oh, Joel! One more step down then from Lanning and she would have been in real trouble. Gets on top of that and hammers it to mid-wicket. She got a lot of it. Beautiful shot. Oh, she's got that two clubs it over mid-wicket again. It was asking to be put away and back-to-back -back boundaries from Lanning. I think she's read the play here. Not a bad move at all. Oh, it was up-ish. Chance? Yeah, definitely. Yep. Oh, and that's into that zone again, and put away. It was Healy on this occasion. And you can't put it there to players of this calibre. Oh, that's not the shot she was after, and she's gone. Extraordinary shot from Elisa Healy. And whether that's just held up a bit, we'll have a look. Sophie Devine breaks through in her first over. Oh, she gets away with one there. That's through. They'll be disappointed. The chance to bat that down at mid-wicket, and she's timed it well enough. That's the great thing about AB Field. We know that it races away. So. Yeah. Nick on! So there it is. Tahuhu gets her, holds the line, gets the outside edge. Martin does the rest. Lanning goes. What? Oh, that's another misfield. So... They've gifted the Australians some runs this over in amongst picking up the wicket of Meg Lanning. Well, that's to feel for it in the end, but she's timed it beautifully. Um, I've not been able to get there, so a boundary to finish. Up until that point was a pretty good over, halfway through three for 56. That's more in the slight, slightly over-pitched. And Gardner good enough to put it away. Perfect example of that. As we see, this is going to race away, I think, is it? To who who after it, over it goes. That's wide and put away. Far too much room, too much width. Gardner good enough. Well, that's up in the air, it's high, yeah. and it's out. So it's a big breakthrough for Sophie Devine, just as his partnership was really threatening New Zealand's hold on this one. Skipper breaks it. Well, that is a big, big wicket for New Zealand. Well, she lofts straight away, and she's gone straight away. So that shot's proving very difficult to play, especially early in the innings. Oh, that was a nick as well. She's got another one. They've gone up. The umpire said no. Oh, we'll come back and have a look at that. It sounded every bit an outside edge. Devine, as Elise said, he's on fire, and this is the last ball of the previous over. Oh. That's... The New Zealanders thought they had another one. Oh, she picked that up beautifully. And on the breeze, has hit it out of the ground. Well, that is a magnificent way to finish the end of the Tahuhu spell from an Australian perspective. Five for 91. Well, she's got a lot of that. She made it the length she wanted, and she's put it into the tree again. 
already. And she goes again. This is what she can do. She can take it away from you, and it's straight into the same spot again, Jonesy. <laughs> She's just uh, riding up the contract now to uh, <laughs> Queensland Cricket. Let's uh, keep keep the tree there. Yes. She's just targeting at yes. the moment. Oh, that's a great-looking shot. Beautifully placed. Magnificent cricket shot from Ash Gardner. That's her 50 up. Well, she's hit three sixes in this innings of 50, but that, for me, is her best shot. You just watch this. She knew the field perfectly. Ash Gardner. Catch! Oh, oh just wide of point and another boundary. She is unstoppable at the moment. Oh. Well, you can't get away with anything to Gardner right now. And she goes again. And she's out. She just didn't get enough of it. And Susie Bates gets the massive breakthrough. And Wareham gives it everything, pins the ears back. And there's the momentum that Elise Villani was talking about. Finishes it off with a lusty blow over mid-off and gets it up to 138 for six at the end of the 20. Wareham nine, not out. Carey seven, not out. Divine the star, three for 18. Well, you rejoin us with the first ball of the Australian bowling effort about to be delivered in this fresh New Zealand opening partnership. T20 cricket. Wait. Megan shoot. Give me a good run chase, this. Oh, it's it's going to be an absolute ripper, isn't it? That's a great shot. Beautifully played. Beautiful shot from Sophie Devine, given time. Okay. That's nicely put away. She's the dangerous player. Oh. And she takes advantage of it. So it was the free hit. It was pitched on leg and over-pitched at that. And one mistake becomes a second and a big one at that for Megan Shoot. And that's the chance. It's got the leading edge. Should be taken. It is. So Kimmins gets the breakthrough. Green goes. Australians have got one back. Down, down. She's crunched that. Jeez. Jeez, that's a powerful blow. <laughs> the leggy comes into the attack. Oh, oh it might have hit the stump. <laughs> Did it make contact with the stump? I reckon it has. Everything that's coming their way. Yeah. Oh, was there a nick? Has she got the stumping? They've gone up for a couple here. I think they've gone for the court behind. That's been turned down. And was she out of the crease? I think Healy thinks she's got her. She's safe, isn't she? I think yeah. she is I think safe, she's safe, but not by a lot. Uh, so that foot is not down. I'm ready to make my decision. My Gee decision whiz. is out. Oh, she's got hold of that. And finds the gap. Breaks the shackles. It's a very nice shot from Amy Satisfait. Well, she's come at it here. She's made it the length she wanted, and she puts it away. Good adjustment. That's not, it's not easy getting it. hold of Jonathan. She hasn't got all of that. Field is coming in, and it lands safely between a couple. Now the Kiwis. Yeah! Oh, she nicked it. She thinks she's got it. Satisfait walks. To go. God. She's Winnie. gone high. It's extremely high. Field is under it. It would have been a magnificent catch. Finish up. She needs that again. That's more like it from Bates. Oh, and that's the sort of stuff that can win you a game of cricket. And that's straight onto leg stump. Martin used the crease beautifully. goes again. So two in the first four, nine from the over. Just what they needed. Martin goes hard and hasn't got enough on it. And the skipper takes the catch. And the plucky resistance from Katie Martin comes to an end. 
Well, she's drawn the air up. Outstanding bowling. Couple of wickets in the third last over. And she breaks the back of the resistance here, Megan Shute. That's nicely hit. That's a beautiful shot. That's gone. So Shoot picks up her third. And Kerr trying to make something special happen falls. It's up ish again. Is it the fourth four? Yes, it is. <laughs> Has she? No, that's a she, glorious that's a shot. Good shot. That's a magnificent shot. Can she pick it up? Oh, the inside edge drags it down to short fine. And with the single, New Zealand moved to 121. 17 runs shy of chasing down Australia's 138. And Australia's winning ways in international cricket and against New Zealand continue.